Okay, in order to solve this question, you need to know a couple of things. The first thing is that cosecant of an angle is the same thing as 1 over sine of that angle. And it's also the same thing as, remember that sine in Sokatoa We can think of sine as opposite over hypotenuse. So cosecant is just thinking of it as hypotenuse because it's the reciprocal over the opposite. We can think of that as cosecant of the angle. So let's start with that. The second thing is that they're telling us that it's in quadrant two. So I'm going to draw a triangle in quadrant two where the angle is T. And they're saying that the ratio between the hypotenuse and the opposite is root 37 to 1. So that's the hypotenuse. Always the hypotenuse is opposite to the 90 degree. And 1 is the opposite to the angle. So therefore, we, with Pythagorean theorem, we know that y in this case in the second quadrant is positive because we moved to this point. We moved up one unit. The hypotenuse is always positive, and we use Pythagorean theorem. We say 1 squared plus x squared equals the square root of 37 squared, which ends up being 37. So then we subtract 1, and we get x squared equals 36. Therefore, x is either positive or negative 36. Therefore, Therefore, because we're in the second quadrant, we are going to make sure that we make it until a negative 6 because in the second quadrant, x is negative. So the, the next thing is we already set up the actual information of cosine and sine of the actual angle. But the question is asking cosine of a double angle, not of the angle itself. So next, we need to know that there are certain identities that we have to follow. And for cosine of a double angle, there's three different identities. But to make the problem short, I'm just going to give you one of the identities. We could have used any one of the three, and you probably have a list of them. So one of the three identities says that in order to find cosine of a double angle, cosine of 2t, we take cosine of squared of the angle t minus sine squared of the angle t. So what does that mean? We take cosine of the angle t, which in this case is cosine, remember it's adjacent over hypotenuse, and in this case it's negative 6 over root 37, but they're telling us to square it, and then we subtract hypotenuse over, my bad, opposite over hypotenuse, 1 over root 37, and we also square that. So the this first ratio becomes 6 over 37, and the next one becomes 1 over 37. So my final answer is 5 37ths. So that is the answer to cosine of a double angle of that double angle, cosine of 2t. So that's all you have to do. Just to make clear, cosine squared of t just means to take cosine of t and take the whole cosine and square it. And the same thing with sine. Sine t and then square the entire ratio. I hope that made it clear.